Hi, and welcome to Science for Schools. In this episode, we're going to be investigating how light is reflected by a mirror. So we have our light source over here. There's a mirror. And just to help with measuring exactly how it's affected, I've got this piece of paper where I'm going to put the mirror on this line. And this line here is exactly perpendicular to that. And I'm going to try and get the beam to hit exactly there. So first of all, let's just get the beam to hit the mirror at this angle. And try and line up the mirror so that the, the actual reflecting part is on the line, not the glass in front of the mirror. So there it is. I'm just going to mark the path of this light so I can do some measurements a bit later. about there and coming out about there and that's all I need for the moment because I can finish those lines since I know exactly where it's hitting the mirror and I'm going to try and get another angle as well just get a narrow one and again try and get it to hit that spot as much as possible and line up the back of the mirror, the metal part, the reflecting part of the mirror with uh, that black line. I'm going to mark the path of the light. Okay, so I'm going to finish these lines, connect them both to where the light hit the mirror. And likewise for the other line. Once again, try to aim it at the same spot in each case. And so you can see we've got uh, certain angles on our side. The light coming in on this red line here comes in at an angle, we usually measure it from this perpendicular line that we call the normal and you hopefully you should be able to see, and you can measure this with a protractor, that the angle on either side of this normal is the same and likewise for the green line, if we measure the angle from the center to each of those light beams, if you measure those angles hopefully they should turn out to be the same as well so thanks for watching and I'll talk to you in the next episode